Some of you might recognise the car that I'm sitting in as the current Carfection long-termer, the Land Rover Discovery Sport. But there are other cars in our lives that are even more long-term. George, for example, behind the camera, has a MGB GT rubber bumper, which he adores. I have a clear 182. But the car that's been longest in my life is a 1979 Mark II Escort rally car. And I thought you might like to know a bit more about it. So let's go and have a look. And here it is, in all its glory. Now, a couple of things to point out. Some of you may know this car already from previous iterations of where I've been. Um, first thing, let's, let's just get there. So everybody points it out. Yes, number plate is DNF, but it's got a, well, it's got a 50% finish rate. So th at the moment, not entirely appropriate. Um, anyway, um, I like it. I like a challenge. Uh, the other thing that people will say is obviously it's not got any arches. Normally you'd, um, in most rally escorts, you get either forest arches, which are actually the little ones, or the big tarmac arches, or even the massive great Monte Carlo arches here. And originally when I bought this car, which is an RS2000, I thought I would turn it into some sort of RS1800 replica and I would put arches on it. And then seeing it in service parks and its little narrow body, I just think there's something very cool about it. You don't see many narrow-bodied um, escorts out there. So I'm, I'm inclined to keep it like that. I'm not going to enter any championships. I'm probably not going to win any rallies in it. I haven't got the money to pump into it with a sort of a BDA or anything like that. Uh, so yeah, it's just for fun. So I think I'm going to keep it unarched for the moment. Um, I've done two rallies in this, uh, mostly through lack of money. Um, I've done the Woodpecker twice, actually. First time we finished uh, second in class, we got a little trophy. Hey. Uh, the other time uh, we failed to get to the end of the first stage, which was last year uh, due to electronics problems. So the plan at the moment with this car is to, well, change various bits and bobs on it. If we have a look in the back here, we'll see. Uh, fuel pumps, knackered, basically. They need to be, need to be changed. Uh, I think it needs a new battery as well. Um, there's some, a lot of it's really nice, uh, but there's various bits of it that just need to be done to make it reliable, basically, so it will get through a rally before we start looking at sort of performance enhancements. So that's the plan over the next few sort of weeks and months is to actually put a bit of money into it and yeah, so I can actually go out and use it. Little Felix the Cat on there. Felix is my middle name. Uh, G. Jones, Gethin Jones, who's uh, my co driver last time out. Brave man, uh, and also a very good driver in his own right. Um, we have a look in here. So, yeah, all the usual sort of rally bits and bobs in there. My lovely Cobra seats, originally developed with um, Colin McRae in mind. Um, the plastic windows here, which are actually really good ones. We've got a four speed rocket box in here. And then if we walk around the front, to have a look. Um, the wheels incidentally painted that nice light blue color. Uh, I did find, or I got sent an image of this car uh, when it was originally rallying and it had proper magnesium uh, lightweight mini lights on it um, painted in exactly that color. I just did it because I, I liked them and I'd seen uh, the Castrol liveried escorts in, in those colors. Uh, under the bonnet, it's a two liter Pinto mighty boat hanger uh, which is obviously what you had in rs2000 so yeah we need to do a few bits and bobs on that um delortos on it uh twin delortos that's it it's still running an english axle at the rear uh and hopefully in the next few months we will get this up and running properly and we're going to do a shakedown on it because it needs a bit of a, a bit of a shakedown we're going to on a rolling road so we'll get the carburetor set up correctly and we'll hopefully take you through all those little bobs with a few more updates if you like this if you'd like to know more so let us know in the comments if you want to see more of this give it a thumbs up say so there we are that's my mark to escort rally car. <laughs>